morning guys welcome back to today's video it's supposed to rain and it looks like rain but i'm praying it doesn't rain i hear thunder do you hear thunder no. sophie thinks that the baby has spots look that's a big spot where right let there. us look at your belly <laughs> she's like no don't look at my belly <laughs> I, I know, you're all staying, you need to have a bath. Yeah, we know. They're, they got rained on last night, you think that they'd be all clean, but they're not. Look, there's a bunch of big white spots. So do you guys see those white spots? I think those are the white spots, it's just that white baby hair that still has to go. So last night, the horses were outside and it started raining. We were supposed to have this really horrible storm and a bunch of funnel clouds were in our area and it was like torrential rain pour and the horses went crazy i have a TikTok, and i have it on instagram the video of the horses going crazy it was so funny they were all running as a herd and it was beautiful my horse is the only horse that hasn't come yet but anyways we came down in the rain they all ran to the gate and we came down in the rain to put them away look at storm's big butt i love that big butt we came down and we were soaked you guys within a second of us coming out the door we were covered in in water like we were just soaked penny we're just we were laughing like it was so oh she's coming it was so awful that we were laughing hysterically it was thunder and lightning and it was just insane the horses were going insane the horses were dripping wet we were dripping wet gabby and i both had on raincoats yeah they didn't work <laughs> but it's times like that when you're together as a group in like a chaotic experience where there's so much drama and everything's going on and you're working together for the better of someone else. Those are like the best horsey experiences. We were all trying to get out here, get our horses in. Our horses were all at the gate. It was just, I don't know. It just felt so good. And then we were in the barn. We we're trying to drive. We we're trying to like make sure everybody's warm and we're all just running to go and do our jobs. Like Sam was closing doors and it was just beautiful. I should have video, but I didn't have the camera with me because it was so wet. Come on, Penny. <laughs> I hate walking through the really tall grass. I'm not gonna lie, I'm terrified of snakes still. Do you like your mask? Hey, do you like it? Not very many flies today though. Hey, you wait here. Look, oh my gosh, look, there are flies. You guys see them? All right, she's gonna, <laughs> she's gonna make me chase her. Come on. Oh, oh, our trailer got soaked. Our trailer got soaked yesterday. What? I'd like to self-load my pony. All right, self-load your pony. Margaret said, just put up the front bar like we usually do if we... She can go under it. I know. We usually put the front bar Here, up. You have to move. She doesn't like backing off the trailer. Penny's like, all right, I'll just sit here and eat hay. So this is the first time I've ever loaded her on the trailer without a treat. And she's chill. She's like, okay, whatever. Hold, Gabby, hold Penny. All right. <laughs> the bar is not going to make a difference. <laughs> Good girl. She goes under it. <laughs> she just goes under it. But train them when they're young to self-load. Uh, what are you doing to my horse? Is she teaching you to not be afraid? So we went to the dollar store and I ended up getting some stuff for our arena. We're going to go and try and build it now. Um, we're, we've kind of been waiting for the weather to clear. It's been really hot. But I bought this, two of them to hang up for horses to go under. I bought these, 10 of them, and they're small. So I don't know like if we should put them on sticks or something to make them bigger or I don't know, but I got 10 of them. Molly always takes them and ruins them. Yeah. Gabby's like, yeah, she does. So hopefully we can keep them. So I also got these and nine of them. These are just plain ordinary dollar store things, but I'm hoping that they help, that they I can make them work. Well, let's get started. This is what we're starting with you guys. So I'm showing them pictures of what I want. Uh, Gabby's gonna make this. Zip ties. They're zip ties. Attach the, them. 
All right, well, I think I have some. Okay, so we all have a night. Well, so Gabby and I are gonna work on a project each and Sylvie wants to use the pylons. We just don't know what to do with them. All I can think is that you can bury them and make it so that you have to weave. Bury them? Like bury the bottoms of them, put them like. Molly. Yeah, Molly's dig. like, dig. Molly's like, dig. those are my dig. toys. Dig. Molly, dig. Ellie's like, oh, dig. dig. Molly, dig. Ellie, dig, dig, get it, Ellie. Oh, Molly, stop. <laughs> stop. Yeah, so oh, like, no, bury them quite a bit and put them in. Get it, Molly, get it. No, Molly, no. Get that one. <laughs> Molly get is determined to get these. She can still get it 100%. I know, so that's all I can go, think. Go, go, but go, also go, you go, can go. use those for a jump. No, Molly. No, Ellie. Yeah. We're not wrecking these ones. We had like so many of these. We even have bigger ones. In fact, we still have bigger ones. I don't know where they are. All right, so let's get to work and then we'll show you guys what we, what we ended up with. So like usual, we have horses down here trying to see what we're doing. <laughs> and oh, look, it looks scary. Look how scary it looks in the wind. Wait, is that where you're gonna put that? I think you should move it somewhere. Okay, so what I think we should do is move it up more and then we'll do like a circle in the inside and put all of our obstacles. I have a lot more of those sticks if you need them. Ow. So I'm going to show you guys what I made. It is so super scary. I'm and Gabby is like the most creative person I know. Oh, I forgot to cut that piece. And I had to help her with this. I did, I had to show you. So she's like, what am I gonna, how am I gonna stick these things in there? And I said, just take the jump things, these things, stick it on there and then tape it. So I have like more. Okay, just leave it, we only need the one. No, we have lots. Anyway, I'm gonna leave them to it. They get stressed out when I try and help. So we have this, it's gonna have poles all the way down. And then if we're going this way, yeah, if we're going this way, and then we have this thing. I thought I had zip ties. We usually use zip ties, and we don't have zip ties. So I just use duct tape, and if it doesn't stick after like rain and stuff, then I'm going to go get more zip ties. But that's it, and from far away, when the wind is blowing, it actually looks scary. But I don't think it'll be too scary, and it's not professional, but I think our horses will like it. Okay, so. They're working on that. I'm gonna do these poles. All right, so I looked at the picture that I had saved and it used two by fours to make this area for you to walk, but I'm just gonna use poles. Okay, I'm exhausted. The heat literally kills you. <sighs> anyway, we're not gonna finish this today <laughs> because you have to have compassion for people when they're working in the sun. But I'm gonna show you what we have and I'm gonna show you what we still have to work with and what we're gonna do with it. We've got this going on, I love it. I don't know if it's gonna stand up to horses walking through it. I, I'm gonna still go and get more zip ties. Then. Yeah, we'll see if it stands up. <laughs> I love your hair. That is adorable. Were you hot? <laughs> you must have been hot. Put your hair in a bun using a. No, it's because it's in the way. It's still in my face. Too. Yeah, my hair's been in my face too. So then we have all this stuff that we haven't done anything with. I did these things. But I don't know if this is too English. I put them four feet apart. Hopefully the trainer will know. And I don't know if we can use this or not. All this stuff we're gonna use. So we have a piece of our bridge, which Sam needs to reinforce before we can use it. We have these three tires plus those four tires. So I don't know if we can do like, you know how they do that thing where you step into them? Uh, we can do that or we can bring out the big tires and fill them with sand like we did in the arena but that was so much work and have them like for step up to the big tires and then we have this and i don't know if it's good but i don't know if it's right i don't i do not know how to do horse stuff <laughs> but anyways i want like a some kind of a thing for us to go through no idea what we're doing with the pylons and that's it we also have these blocks that we could use for something and we have the pool. She's like, what's in there, mama? Oh, <laughs> there's a bee. Oh. I already did that, it just comes back. Uh-oh, 
Don't let her it bite her. I can't decide whether it's a bot fly or whatever they're called. Tanya is literally and has always been the least afraid horse. Like she just, I, and it makes sense to me that babies will just go and do whatever you ask them to and not be scared. Is that her disposition? Is that a normal thing for babies? And then something happens later in life, like maybe when they start getting trained, they get scared. Like when does the fear factor show up? Oh. Even Ellie's tired. Oh. <laughs> That was so funny! That's how she steps over a pole. <laughs> she, that's how she steps over a pole. <laughs> Sophie was trying to get her to go through the end of that little tunnel. And she was like, I do not know what you want. So she backed up. And then the next time she jumped over it. <sighs> oh, good girl! Good job, Gabby. Good job. I love it. So that's the thing. Gabby. I had a fourth one. Sophia only did Hey, what about the last one there? Sophia only did three. So she's a little spooky over there. She's like rushing underneath it. Alright, let's try and get her through this. Uh-oh. No! <laughs> Not yet! We want it to last a day before it falls apart. It will! I could I, have to put this I could poke holes through there and then use zip ties. So I'm gonna get some zip ties and then we're gonna reinforce everything. She's like, this, this is scary. <laughs> Good girl. So you should keep doing that until she stops rushing underneath it. She's so spooky. So I just say she's never spooky and then she's a little spooky. But that that's normal. Like that takes. Never seen something like that. Yeah, she's never seen something like that before. Good girl. It's going to pour rain and then close. She's getting, better. She's getting better. Good girl. Good girl. Yeah. Good girl. Give her a pat. I did. She might find it. Just walk over it. Oh. Okay. Oop. Okay. <laughs> Clearly those are not going to work out. Just like me with Penny in the trailer, every day a little bit more work. So use tires to make another thing, like you know how I have the poles down there? I could also do that with tires, make like a little path between the tires. So I'm gonna go home and research everything and then figure out what I wanna do. But I wanna like, we left the out lot outside for Sophie to work on in her lessons and we're probably gonna move all this stuff and have this whole area here, like this whole area here for her to do like side passes and all that kind of stuff. But we have to clean up all this stuff because <laughs> it's not finished yet. Oh, beautiful. The bug was chasing Sophie. It's chasing. Oh. Kill it. <laughs> oh, you got it? <laughs> so she's really interested in everything. She just keeps looking at everything, trying to play with it. She loves the pylons. We should maybe throw some pylons in the arena and let the horses play with them. I like to put different stuff in there for them. This is already blowing in the breeze. Look at how scary that looks though. You know what, mine look pretty stable. Yeah. I kinda have faith. You have faith? You kinda have faith? The zip tiles probably will cut through the pool at Okay, so that is it for today's video. It was gloriously windy out here. When you're working, you get really, really hot, but it's nice now. We're gonna go put the horses on grass and we're gonna finish this up tomorrow. And hopefully we'll have something that looks a little bit nice. Just go gentle. Don't you know that you're beautiful?